Uh, it's Kingdom of Osgood Medieval Festival time this weekend. As a matter of fact, joining us this morning, uh, uh, Bill Fadun is here, who is the fight marshal. Hi, Bill. How are you? Well, just fine, thank you. Good, good. And uh, the uh, director of entertainment over there is a man named Spew. Hey. How are you, I'm Spew? I'm very well. Good morning. <laughs> good, good. You all set for this weekend? Everybody set to go? All Absolutely. Set. We're ready for we're ready in for everything that could possibly happen. Our knights are good to go? Uh, you better believe yeah, it. They're alive, by the way. They're not just statues. They're people in, in full getup, correct? That's absolutely right. Yeah. Uh, first of all, Spew, tell me about what's going to go on this weekend because there's more than just knights in shining armor. That's right. It actually starts tomorrow with entertainment, uh, sorry, education day, which is predominantly geared towards children and students. And that goes on all day tomorrow. And that's sold out. So we're, we're Oh, is that right? Yep. Yeah. And then the festival itself starts on Saturday morning with the gates opening at 9.30, goes till 5. And then we have a feast in the evening. And then on Sunday, 9.30 to 5 again. Family entertainment, very affordable, very fun, not there's not a minute where there's not something going on you, through the Kingdom site. Do you get a lot of people uh, coming out to the Kingdom of Osgood? We have actually people coming from Montreal, Toronto. They come from all over for this event. Is that right? Yep. Yeah. A lot of people involved in this sort of activity, oh, this medieval sort oh of gosh, thing? Oh gosh, we had about 3,000 people last year. Right, and uh, they do this in other places, right? So well, you go to other festivals and right. stuff? Yes. Well, some of us do, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah no doubt. I mean, why would you want to keep this in the closet for once a year? Yeah. Really? Well, it's, well, it's because this is uh, this is sort of an Ottawa thing, and we're proud of it. We're, right. we're proud of Ottawa. We like to do this right here in Ottawa. We don't go to any uh, any any other festivals except ours. Now, do you have uh, you have jousting? Yes, uh, Shane Adams will be there with his uh, his jousting troupe. He's out of Acton, Ontario. Oh yeah. And he's one of the finest. He's actually the world a world famous jouster. Really? And um, they actually. Uh, they, they uh, what do you call it? They, they get a certification in really? England to get to, to be a jouster. I'd like and to he, try this and, jousting. <laughs> well, he uh, he said he couldn't be here today. No. You know, so there's a sword fighting as well. We're right? going to be doing a uh, at least two hours worth of sword fighting really? in this stinking heat. Uh, there's not just us, but there's other uh, sword fighting guilds well, in the area. I can't imagine even this morning. Like it's warm this morning, but it's not as humid as it was yesterday. I can't imagine walking around with how many, how many pounds of of stuff do these guys have on? I think we're talking about 45 pounds of this plus the chain mail. Here is about 100, 100 pounds complete with all the chain mail down there that you can oh see. Oh my lord. Okay, and all that helmet. And we're talking easily 65 to 70 pounds right. of this beautiful armor and right here. And this is probably lighter material than they used to do uh, use back in the medieval times. Uh, no, it's about the same. About the same? We're, we're trying hard to keep it as much as authentic as possible. Yeah. Now, a lot of people make their own stuff. Is that true? I have a workshop outside in, in the you village of Metcalf. You make it. I know that. Yeah. And uh, the, all these guys have made their own armor. I didn't make these these armors. These are actually made by the people that are wearing them. Right. Right. So. <laughs> Right. So, so this so is this there's is, actual sort of almost real fighting. I think I think it's as close to real fighting as we can get without anybody without, getting hurt. Without actually anybody getting hurt. Uh, can exactly. you give us an example of how this goes? Well, sure. Uh, uh, Jeff, Mark, would you come out here. Come over here. Fight. Wow. Grace. So you actually have to marshal these, Bill? Oh, I see. Fight! Careful, everybody. Careful. Okay, hold to your corners. So you would actually marshal the fight? Absolutely. That's right? my and, job. And I'm the referee. referee. Yeah. You're I'm the referee. referee. We'll have a little more. You want to show us a little more before okay. we go to break? Hey, Jay. Yeah? We're going to go up against Mark. There's a lady in that armor, isn't there? Yes, there is. I actually. knew that. <laughs> Can't you tell? Yeah. <laughs> lady recognition is really high. And good <laughs> That's <stuff>. true, eh? <laughs> it's the Kingdom of Osgood Medieval Festival coming up this weekend. Uh, OsgoodMedievalFestival.com is the website if you want to find out more information. Enjoy yourself. Oh, the King's Feast is Saturday. The King's Feast?